so it's like twelve fifty nine with free shipping. So you don't pay shipping on it. It's free shipping. It's included, and you're getting great quality. It's not like you're getting um, where it's stitched up and everything, and then it's just well, it's okay quality or whatever. No, this is wonderful, great quality. I kid you not. Um, again, uh, don't take my word for it. Go ahead and jump on it and order it, and you will not be disappointed. You will actually be all in all and in and, and in love. Okay, so what I was saying is that it's from. I'm not sure how to say it. S as in Sam, U as in Ig or U as in uh, U.S. I guess that's how you would want to say that. Z as in zebra, H as in Heather, O as in octopus, and U as in U.S. Okay. The reason why I'm showing you that because it comes from China. Here, let me hide all this and come right over here. Okay. It's a uh, oh gosh, why is it so blurred out? But it says China there. That's where it comes from. So if you see that, this is where you most likely will actually get the white dress that you want if you really like the one that I got and ordered. I'm in, in love, and the way they um, have it worded, clothing accessories. Um, KG is zero point two. Uh, Val, as in, um, I guess that's for U.S. dollars, twelve fifty nine, and it says good region China. Um, yeah, I mean this is really good product. I mean, just wow. So, if you really want it, I suggest that you jump on and get it because I am telling you that it is wonderful. And if you're a big Frozen fan, big Cinderella fan, go ahead and jump on that. And if you see uh, this new Cinderella dress, if you see different colored butterflies, but you see one in the picture that you really like, you can actually do what I did. I contacted a seller, and whoever they are, they're very good, very nice, and they pick out the butterfly that you want, plus you get the one that nobody was supposed to come with the dress. But they put the color that you want right here. So you get two butterflies and a dress. And that is also $12 and like 59 cents. Or was it 13? So for that reason, still shipping is included, but you get the butterfly. And if you choose a color that you see in the picture or that you want even, contact the seller. They're, they put it on there for you. It's uh, with a pin and it goes right through the fabric you just want to be careful and it goes right through and there you go there's your butterfly and your uh we make of cinderella's dress this here has already been made so you don't even have to ask for anything for the frozen one i mean everything is right there you just ask them that is the train white color not you know and they'll tell you yes or uh and Go ahead and jump on it and they'll ship it to you and it's going to be wonderful. Oh, I just realized that they left a sticker on this. Um, ah, okay, that I did not know. Um, so yeah, I definitely recommend um, this dress a lot, by a lot. Um, I'm so happy with my purchase. I'm so thrilled. And now, I cannot wait to put it on one of my dolls and I know I don't have one that looks like Elsa you know as a doll but I do have blonde heads I won't put it on them even though I could but I'm and I know I could put it on like um what I call Rosalie um uh, oh my gosh what is your name Caroline I know I can put it on her I could put it on one of my other dolls that have blue eyes and blonde hair or brown eyes with blonde hair um but i'm thinking about i'm just going to put it on one of my other dolls like uh the one that i named krista or laura or even um crystal gale which that's what i named her she's got dark hair but i'm thinking about putting it on one of them not tonight um possibly uh, hopefully maybe tomorrow if not tomorrow then uh, some other time when I have more time to 
to do that and film it and, and put on the tripod and all that good stuff because I would love to put it on the tripod and change my doll into um, this dress so that we can see what it looks like on her and then maybe leave it on her for a while. Another outfit that I love and it came from a lady on Facebook and she's really nice and I'm not going to give her a last name and I, I won't probably say her first name either but I want to show you something that she's done for me and I'm so thankful for. Okay, my Sage doll. She made, can you see that right there? Yeah, that outfit right there. I'm zooming it in. I know I did a video on it once. This outfit right here, this beautiful dress. That's on my Sage doll. Uh oh, I zoomed in now I can't. Okay, there we go. I was going to say, now I can't zoom out. That outfit, that beautiful dress. I wanted one that looks like Little House on a Prairie. She made me that dress. And I have to tell you, I am so in love with that dress. I cannot take her out of it after I put her in the dress. I had her in PJs. And I took her out of the PJs and I put her in that dress. And I'm so in love with it. I'm so in awe. And that dress is not coming off of her. And I love it on her. Yes, I have a little white bowl. I know, I got some stuff that over there that I'm, I need to store away and put away. And I just haven't got to the chance to do it yet. Um, but yeah. So there she is in that beautiful dress. It's got like little lace on the bottom. It's got this overlay that goes over it. She's got even the hat. Just like Little House on a Prairie. And I, I kid you not, it's more beautiful in person than it is on camera. This is the PJ she was actually wearing. I put it on my dog, my dark-headed girl right here. It's um one of those onesie PJs or whatever you want to call it. I had it on her, and I just cannot take her out of the dress after I put her in it. I was like, oh, she's definitely my little Hustle and Perry doll. Even though Laura, the one I named Laura, is supposed to be from Little Hustle and Perry. I put Sage in that and I, ha I love how her hair is because Sage's hair is kind of like in um I don't want to call it a braid but it's like in a twist type of style and almost like it looks like a braid and it actually keeps her hair from getting messed up you know I'm kind of walking around because I was trying to do something um so it keeps the hair from getting messed up and that's one reason why I have not changed her out of the dress but I'm going to see if I can get you a better light. There it is. Right there. And it keeps her hair nice too. So the way her hair doesn't get messed up. So that's probably one reason why I didn't put it on my doll that I named Laura. Now Laura from Little House on the Prairie. Um, a lot of them do custom on their American Girl doll. Mine is not. I just took. I didn't. I, like I said. I did not take nothing about her. Um. How do I want to say this? So, I ended up with two sages. And the reason why I ended up with two sages is because once, once I got sage, I liked her a lot. So, I got sage. So, when I got her, I was like, you know, the same seller that I bought her from, she had, a, she had two sages. So, I was like, I like to name one Laura and one sage. Even though it's going to be the same doll, but I don't want to do any custom. Because she's perfect to be Little House on the Prairie. So, my Laura that's on the bed. Her hair is a mess right now because she's been sleeping on the bed for a while. Uh, against a wall and her hair looks like, like bed hair. So, uh, I have to fix that probably tomorrow. Well, anyway, so make the long story short. I contacted the seller that I bought sage from and I said I know you have a second sage I would love to buy her off of you because I would like to have one named Laura because she looks like to me she looks like Laura House in a Prairie so when uh, the seller on so I got it from her uh, it was months later obviously um, the person or I, well she is a person but She's been really good, really nice.